What's up there guys, Peter Gilmore here for another video right here on Metal God 66. Nah. Thank you all for watching and make sure you hit the hit the like button down below. Subscribe to my channels all down below. Find me on follow me on social media. Share the video all over the internet. Don't forget to tap that bell. So on all notifications. And hopefully you get notified. If not, well, too bad. All right, just going to make this short and sweet. Now I know I said I'm on. A, I'm, I'm taking some time off. That and that's going to be. It's been happening the last uh, really uh, two days or so. So, but well, I did say I'm going to do a uh, Christmas and New Year's uh, video as well. And then I'm gonna take the I'm, I'm actually gonna take the break. So I want to just get through the holidays and then take the break, um, which I don't know how long that's gonna be. Maybe three, four, five months. I don't know. We'll see. But wanted to come on and um, just pay my respects uh, to Charlie Wolfcale, who passed away. Um, just uh, we heard the news yesterday. Um, I got the, I got the news from. Um, from Scott Casey Gale, and then I, I had to refer to Jerry, and that, that, that's that's it. And um, I just want to pay my respects to Charlie. Charlie was a great man. I knew him from basically when I started on this toxic, dangerous website. And you know, at first, I, you know, he had a really high voice, like almost like high pitched Eric of the Howard Stern show or something like that. And he was a character, man. He, he would scream at the top of his lungs. He would get into like many, many feuds with old, the old time old YouTubers, old, old school YouTubers, new school YouTubers. You know, I, I remember the feuds they had with. With um, Will and Jesse of, De of Death Clark Armageddon, and some other fights with other people, he even threatened. You remember he had a video where he had, had a knife and says he was gonna cut some people and stuff like that. Guy was crazy, and um, then he he, he was a good he was a good runner. I'll, I'll tell I'll, I'll be I'll be honest. I mean I'm a good runner, but I think he's a he's, he's a pretty damn good runner. Always, always talked about the WWE and you're saying saying it's garbage and this and that. I mean, he did a video. He, he got really controversial at times. I mean, he he started talking about Shinsuke Nakamura and said he should go back to Japan and, you know, calling him different names and stuff. But, I mean, it is what it is. But, you know, all, we come out here, We sometimes we play a character... We play ourselves sometimes, you know what I mean? I play a character, you know, Peter Gilmore's not my real name, we, we all know that. Um, but, I play a character on here, you know, but I be real. I'm a real character, I play a real character with a real stage name. But, anyway. But, me and Charlie, uh... We were friends in the early kind of day, in the early days of the... Of the what WC and then when the, when um you know who showed us you know why and then around the around the same time we were still friends I think I don't remember but I might have helped him to help defend him against uh, Will and Jesse at the time I don't remember much from my 2015 past uh, the only thing I m remember past 2000 uh 2015 is a couple of things and you know that incident with the you know. But other than that, Charlie was a character. Me and Charlie were friends at certain times. And then we had a little spat. Uh, where he called me uncharismatic and didn't have passion. And, and you know, I said I might have said a certain, some things that maybe I I didn't mean. But you know, through the, through the, through the years, um, I basically didn't really watch him a lot. And, um, I, I never thought that I wanted to 
make peace with him at certain times. I mean, I did, but certain times I was like, eh, no, I'm not, I don't want to sometimes. But, you know, hearing about his passing yesterday, and I'm only doing this just to do the video. And um, like I said, I'm on break, but um, I had to do the video to pay my respects. So, but I, I, I just wish, you know, I would have talked to to Charlie back in maybe a couple of years ago, and just kind of squashed the beef. I let I like, let you go your way. You, you go, I'll go my way. You don't have to agree with me, and anything like that. And that would have been fine with me, but now I can't do that. But you know, Charlie was a character. You know, he had his demons and everything. He he was, you know. With wrestling and the bottle and substance abuse, hopefully that wasn't the reason. Well, I uh, I think his sister said um I think one of some video one of the videos, I think it was Polson's video, that that he didn't die of alcohol from out al of alcohol, so it's not alcohol. So could be substance abuse. Hopefully it's not COVID, but you know. Just sad that he has passed away at the age of 36. He's very young. And um, we already lost a, a YouTuber already. Uh, another YouTuber, Cody Brainer, he died at 23 from uh, stage 5 brain cancer. And we, we never thought that we would lose another YouTuber. Especially a legend. You know, you talk about legends, you got Charlie, uh, Charlie me, WJ, and other people. But, but I I think besides WJ and and me, Charlie was like almost like the number one guy, big time ranter. You know, I would la I would laugh sometimes at, at his um rants and stuff. You know, he was yelling at his grandma, and then sometimes you know it, it was kind of funny. But no, I mean not, not I'm not saying that's a bad thing, but you know just 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 the memories I have of Charlie and everything. But you know. It's sad that to see him go. I mean, I w I really wish he was around. He was around, you know, still around, and um, just talking about wrestling and just talking about whatever music. He was a, b a big death metal fan, I believe. But you know, he leave he leaves his family behind him. Leaves his grandma behind him. It's sad, and um, all I gotta say is uh. To Charlie, I know you're up there in heaven. I uh, just want to pay my respects to to you and to Charlie. I want to pay my respects to Charlie. Rest in peace, Charlie, and to Charlie's family, the Wolf Kale family. Um, I pay. I send my condolences, and that's pretty much it. All right, so that's my video. I'm gonna go back to watching SmackDown and um, enjoy my um weekend and get ready for the holidays, and then um. After that, after the new year, I'll be out of here. So, because so, already pulled the, I pulled the plug already, but I'm only doing this video to pay respects for, to Charlie, and that's that. And you know, to be to be honest with you guys, the the whole the, the whole thing with every, whoever has a beef with somebody, I don't think I, and now it's doing the holidays. Just not do not have the beef anymore just just end it or just you know you know just stop really because you know like i said t youtube is becoming a dangerous place right now dangerous with with um all the all the doxing and all this stuff you know s somebody might get you know something might 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 happen and it's not you know not going to be good and somebody might, you know, get in big trouble. But well, I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not trying to think that. But that's why. That's why. Basically, why I left. It's not because of the trolls, and not because of anything else. Basically, because I don't want to be here anymore and, and be on a toxic website that doesn't take care of these people. So that's why I'm. That's why I'm getting out. But this whole this whole thing. If people got a beef, um, don't can don't. don't do it during the holidays. Do it after the holidays. After the new year. Just do it then. Don't do it now. Especially when you hear 
a certain YouTuber has passed away. And you're gonna you're gonna do videos uh, just you know continuing your beef or whatever. It makes no sense. So I mean, pay your respects and then get the hell out of here. You know, just handle your business next year. But you know, it is what it is. Can't please everybody. But anyway, I'm gonna end here. Like I said, I was gonna do that before, but I'm gonna I'm gonna actually end here. Um, and and Charlie, you're a great man, great runner. Uh, wish I could uh could have uh mended fences with you and uh, squashed our little beef that we had. And uh, that's all I gotta say about that. Hope you're having a great time in that big big wrestling paradise up there in heaven and hopefully God is protecting you because I know he will protect your family in this time of mourning so that's it so to uh, Charlie's family I, I pay my condolences and to Charlie Wolfcale you will be missed my friend just like Cody Brainer and um, you'll be missed and all I have to say is God bless you Charlie may you rest in peace and that's all I got to say about that. Take care, Charlie. And everybody, I'll see you guys soon. Next time.